सत्याकाल नमस्ते हेलो एवरीवन माय नेम इज सोनल मिश्रा स्टडिंग इन बी एड फ्रॉम चंडीगढ़ कॉलेज ऑफ एजुकेशन सो टुडेज टॉपिक ऑफ माइन इज गुरु तेग बहादुर जी अर्ली लाइफ एज यू नो वी आर ऑल हेयर फॉर सेलिब्रेटिंग द ऑस्पिशियस ओकेजन ऑफ गुरु तेग बहादुर जी फोर हंड्रेड प्रकाश पूरब विच इज बींग सेलिब्रेटेड ऑन मे फर्स्ट दिस ईयर He was the ninth of the tenth gurus who founded the Sikh religion. He was also considered the Sikh leader from 1665 until his demise in 1675. You know what? Guru Tegh Bahadur Ji's early name was Tyagmal. What is mean by Tyagmal? That is the master of pronunciation. His father's name is Guru Har Gobind Ji and his mother's name is Mata Nanki Ji. He spent most of his childhood in Amritsar where he learned different languages like Sanskrit, Hindi, Gurmukhi and different Indian religious philosophy from Bhai Gurdas, archery from Baba Buddha and swordsmanship from his own father that is Guru Har Gobind Ji. You know what? When he was only 13 years old, he accompanied his father into the battle of Kartarpur where he fought with Pandey Khan and the Mughals of Sajan he uses his sword left and right and after the battle was won by them he was honored with the new name that is Guru Tegh Bahadur ji what is mean by Tegh what that is the builder of the sword he delved into his studies and spent most of his time in medications to living into his given name that is master of pronunciation he was married to the mata gur ji at kartarpur in 1632 After the ultimately death of his son Bhai Gurditta, Guru Har Gobind Ji decided to start grooming his grandson, that is the Har Rai, to the next successor. He asked Guru Tegh Bahadur Ji to move to his uh, village with the wife and his mother. For the next twenty years, the master of pronunciation spent most of his time in meditation in an underground room. Before Guru Har Krishan Ji passed to the God Courts, he indicated that his successor would found in a village of Bakala. Earlier, the Sikh trader Makhan Sa was prayed to the God when his ship was caught in a violent storm. That if his ship was reached safely to the port, he will give five hundred coins to the successor of the Guru Har Krishan Ji. When the Makhan Sa reached the village, he decided to give each guru two, two gold coins and. each guru in turn blessed and pleased him when makhan sa was about to leave the village a child told him yet another holy man was meditating in an underground room and again makhan sa was bored and gave two gold coins to the guru and in return guru said that why have you broken your promise when you pray to the god to save your ship from the violent storm and you gave 500 gold pieces to the guru Kanchi was overjoyed and announced that true guru has been found, and that is Guru Tegh Bahadur Ji. Guru Tegh Bahadur Ji became ninth of the tenth guru. During 1666, the guru was traveling to the east of Patna when Mata Guru Ji gave a birth to the son named Guru Gobind Singh. When he was preaching his teachings everywhere, an arrest order has been issued by the Emperor Aurangzeb and was executed under the orders of Aurangzeb in 1675. Guru Tegh Bahadur Ji composed 116 sabds and 15 rags and his teachings have been included in the Adi Granth too. He gives many teaching. One of the favorite teachings of his mind is give up your head but forsake not those whom you have undertaken to protect. Sacrifice your life but relinquish not your faith. That means he taught his disciples to protect the ones who need protection even if it comes at the cost of one's own life and this day was evenly known as sahidi divas thank you